Okay, here's the pan pipe. This is Martin, by the way. This is a different type. It has two rows. I'm not here to explain this one. I'm here to explain this one. The ones my kids made in school. Okay, guys, I just got to show you one thing right now. The most thing, the most important thing is where to put the tube on your face. Touch your nose. Go straight down to your bottom lip. Now you're in the middle of your lip because the nose is in the middle of your face. You're on the middle of your lip. At the same time, keep your finger there. Touch your chin. Great. Now, put all four of your fingers together like that. Sometimes it might seem hard, but it's not. I want you to make them all the same. Here's number one, two, three, and four. Your little finger is number one. Watch this. Oh, I'm putting it in the same spot, right in the middle of my lip. Never over here. Put it right there. Then put the next one and the next one. And the next one. Here's number one because he's the littlest one. One, two, three, and four. Four is the biggest. I'm going to put the little one on my t on the middle of my lip and against my chin. And when you do that, you're not pressing the instrument. You're not scratching your lips across. Well, that's why we sanded it so it's nice and smooth. You can always sand it a little more if you like. But we did a great job in class and we checked them all. Anyway, put the little one there, and we're not talking about blowing it, so you have to listen to this. This is important. <laughs> and then against your chin. I say that because a lot of my kids like to be blowing while we're talking, and you got to listen to this first. Now go to the next one, number two. Go to number three. And go to number four. This is important, this number one step. You have to know where the tubes are. So you don't go, dun, dun, dun. hey, oh, it's over here, you know, okay? So watch me play this little guy. And watch that it's always under my nose. That's just me pulling around. Now, how do you play the thing? Simple. You keep your mouth relaxed and you open your mouth just a little bit. We're not talking about sticking our lips out and we're not going to blow like this. Watch. You're not telling your brain to blow up. Keep your mouth still and I want you to stretch your muscles here this way. Watch what happens. I'm going to relax my mouth. Then I'm going to open my mouth a little bit, and then I'm going to stretch my muscles. Watch. Like I'm smiling. And when you do it, it's hard to talk, because you'll feel your teeth under there. It's like my skin is stretched over my teeth. That's all you got to do. And then we're going to do this action. This is part two you now. Like, we're going to spit. It's the only way I can tell you how to do this. Um, Spitting is not exactly the nicest thing in the world, but let me show you. I'll see if I can get a close-up, okay? You should see only my tongue, maybe my throat move. Notice my lips aren't moving and my cheeks aren't blowing up like a goldfish. Okay, there you go. Let me show you. I'll put... I'll go back to my very first thing. Number one, in the middle of my face. I don't need to be doing this anymore. You know this. In the middle, there. I'm going to blow one time. Take it away. Do it again. Now I'm going to go each one. The bigger they are, the more you have to push a little bit. You will get a little dizzy, so don't worry about it. But don't get up and try to go run around the block. Always relax a little bit after you play these guys. So teachers, when you do your practice, stop. 
have everybody take a deep breath. Let the air out in, in slowly. Let the air out slowly. And do that for a couple times just to kind of get the breathing back in there. Um, this goes away. The dizziness goes away the more you play. Believe me. Don't forget. Okay? You have to use the tongue. That's how you get that sound. There's short little blast. Enjoy. Talk to you soon.